Wednesday morning, a wicked Wednesday morning at that. So, today we got three blocks. The first block, everything is on the minute. We'll do two laps through, take a little break. The second block is timed. We do all four exercises for 90 seconds, and then all four again at 60 seconds for a nice little break. And then the last block is technically three mini blocks. We got two exercises, 30 seconds apiece for three laps. And we uh, knock that out, and then we're done. So, with that said, you want some dumbbells um, for the first and, I believe, third block. And second block, actually. And uh, I would say a lighter set for that second block. And then you want a medicine ball for that end of the third block. Um, if you don't have a medicine ball, that's fine. I can show you how to do the same exercises with a dumbbell instead. So, that being said, uh, first block, we got alternating front to lateral raise. So, what that looks like from that stand position, shoulders are back. We lift those arms straight up in front, control down, straight up to the side, making that capital T. You want to avoid going over the shoulder head itself, just trying to stop right there. We then have squats. These can be body weight. You don't need weight. Just sitting down in those hips, explode it up. Push-ups, walls, knees, or toes. However you want to knock out those push-ups. A basic bridge where you just start on the ground, on your back, drive up through those heels, control it back down. Again, that option, you can add weight on those hips. And then a lateral lunge, just sitting it side to side. Again, not necessarily needing that weight unless you want it. So crew, without further ado, let's grab those light weights and get going with that first minute. All train that front raise into lateral raise in three, two, and one. Here we go. Shoulder blades back, core is tight. Taking those arms straight up, control down, straight to the side, control it down. Looking good, crew. Now you don't need to go speedy on this, and you want to listen to those shoulders. You can always rotate where the palms are if opening them up gets a little weird, meaning instead of facing forward, you can have them face downward when you go front, and lateral instead of facing down, you can have them face outward. So again, just listen to that body. We got 15 seconds here. And then we got those squats. Okay, crew, let's get ready. One minute of those bodyweight squats. We take it up in three, two, and one. Again, feet about shoulder width apart. Sit down in those hips. Slowly up. That option here, again, you can hold that weight from that chest. The focus when you sit it back. Nice, slow tempo. Quick return up. Take three to five count down. One count up. Looking good. Weight staying in those heels. 30 seconds we get to push up. Love it, love it. You got 15. Squeezing those hips at the tip top. Okay, crew, get ready. We got push ups next. One full minute. They can be walls, knees, or toes in three, two, and one. Push up position. Get nice and low. Drive it up. Again, you can always do this from the knees. Just make sure you're not sitting back in that butt. Looking good. Elbows going at that 45 degree angle. Core staying tight. Love it crew, we got 30 down, 30 to go. Again, listen to that body scene, drop to those knees at any time, go crazy. Looking good, about 15 seconds left in this minute. Then we're gonna go to bridges next. Okay, crew, let's get ready. We're going to flop it over, get onto that bridge in three, two, one, and bridge it. Feet about shoulder width apart, driving those hips up, nice slow control down. Again, that option, hold that weight in those hips as we drive it up, slow and control down. The emphasis, butt and back and legs, if you're not quite feeling it there, step those feet out slightly and point those toes to the sky, squeeze at the top, 
control on that way down. And looking solid, we got 30 down, 30 into those lateral lunges. Looking good, looking good, crew. Keep that drive going. We got about 10 seconds. Let me go up to those lateral lunges. And three, two, and one. Lateral lunge. You can hold that weight in front of the chest if you want to. Otherwise, just step it. Sitting in those hips. We got that many to work. If you want to make it more cardio, we can add that hop. Otherwise, again, use this as that opportunity to really focus sitting down back, getting that stretch on that inner thigh. Looking good, you got 30 down, 30 to go. Remember, we repeat this whole block one more time, starting with an alternating front to lateral raise. Fifteen seconds, crew. Looking solid. Let's get it ready. We got that alternating front to lateral raise in three, two, and one. Shoulder blades back. Core tight. Here we go. Take it up. Control it down. Whew. Last time we're going to do these raises. So focus on that control. Again, it's not about speed. Looking solid, crew. Pass that halfway mark, we get squats next. Looking good, looking good. Let's get ready for those squats. Again, it's gonna be on that minute, that option. Hold that weight in front of that chest. We take you there in three, two, and one. Here we go, squat time. Feet shoulder width apart, sit it down back, drive it on up. Squeezing at the top. Looking solid here, crew. We got 30 down and 30, we're gonna go back to push ups. Again, we can play with the tempo on these exercises to increase that difficulty by going nice and slow down. Drive it up. Also, gets us more bang for the buck. Let's get ready. We got push ups on that minute in three, two, one, let's go back to push-ups. Knees or toes, get low, drive it up. Looking good here, crew. Again, we always go on those knees if we need it. Looking good. We've got about 20 seconds to go. And then we're going back in those bridges. Crew, we go back to bridges on that minute in three, two, and one. Again, that option, hold that weight in those hips. Drive it up, control it on down. Again, for that bonus option, point those toes to the sky, focus butt back of legs.
one count up, two to three counts down. That's going to help us get a little bit more bang for our buck. Halfway, then we get that final minute lateral lunges. Looking good, looking good. Last couple of seconds. Let's hang on to it, crew. We take the lateral lunge in three, two, and one. Lateral lunge, again, you need to hold that weight in front of the chest if you like. Otherwise, we just step it, sit back into those hips. Front knee behind that front toe relative. Looking good, crew. Thirty down, thirty to go. Let's keep those hips moving. Ooh. Last fifteen, crew. Looking good. We're about to take that nice little break in three, two, and one. Take that nice little break. So your next round, we've got everything on the 90, and then we do everything again on the minute. What this looks like is it starts with the frogger. Chest proud, feet a little bit wider in this one. Sit as low into the squat as you can. You want to try and touch the ground, but you don't want to tip that chest forward. So try and get as low as you can. Explode it up. That option, sit down into it. Give me that calf raise. We then have dumbbell jabs. You hold those weights in those hands. We're going to alternate jabbing forward. That option, no weights. Same thing, jab it forward like a rubber band, snap it back. Then we got that jack press. So as you jump it out, you press the weight away from the chest, jump it in, bring the weight in. Option, tap it out and in, or no weight at all, just give me a jumping jack variation. Lastly, we've got what's called a roller coaster. So think hands wide, feet wide. You're gonna snake underneath that fence and then push it back. I always go onto my knees, same thing. Dive underneath that fence line and push it back. So again, we got 90 of all those. Then we got a minute of everything. Let's go ahead and get ready. Let's see if I can't get music playing again. All right, timer's resetting and we start with those froggers in three, two, and one. Here we go, froggers. Feet about shoulder width apart or wider, sit down, explode up. Again, that option for a little tired, give me that calf raise, sit down, and calf raise. Remember, this is a little bit more cardio because you're here for a longer time, so don't blast yourself out of that gate. Looking good. Less than a minute until those jabs. Love it, love it, crew. Let's keep that body moving. Last 30 seconds. Let's get this ready in 15. We got those dumbbell jabs. Again, that option, no weight at all, just jab it out. Let's get ready. We jab it out in three, two, and one. Let's jab it out. Grab those weights. You can send those hips slightly, core tight. Power that jab. Looking good. Keeping those shoulders back. Let's snap it. Whew. Again, this isn't a sprint. So if you need to slow it down, slow it down. Because remember, this is 
A little bit of weight for those shoulders. Pass that halfway, looking good. Feel that burn. Again, if you need to drop it and just press it or jab it, you can. Otherwise, we got about 30 seconds to go. Fifteen. Ooh. Let's get ready. We got those jack presses. So again, just one weight. That option, no weight at all. In three, two, one, 90 seconds, jack and press. Again, that option, step it and press it. Whew. Again, we're getting a little sweaty in this round. That option again, just hold that weight in front of the chest. No weight at all. Jacking those legs. Less than a minute to go. Looking good, crew. Ooh. Again, if you feel like you're only on your toes, try and land on those heels. That's gonna get more of that back compartment in the leg. Less than 30. Oh, I got myself off. There we go. Okay, crew, in 15, we got those roller coasters. Best effort here, again, not a sprint. Crew, we got roller coasters in three, two, and one. Roller coaster. Again, hands nice and wide, feet nice and wide, hips up. You sneak underneath that fence line, then you push it back. We do this from the knees, get underneath the fence line, push it back. Okay, can you hold it for a second? Hold it for a second because you are here for 90 seconds. Then you can drop down the knees at any point if you need to. Looking solid, 45 to go. Then we got a minute of everything starting with those rogers. Looking good, 30 seconds. Whew. You can take those knees one minute if you need to. This is doing a lot of range of motion for those shoulders. We got just 15. Getting ready to go back into those froggers for one minute. Crew, we take you there in three, two, and one. Frogger, here we go. Just one minute. Again, sit in those hips. Calf raise instead, if needed. Whew. Looking solid, crew. Sit back into it. So remember, three more exercises. Each on that minute until your next break. Give me that best effort. Whew. Less than 30. Looking good. 15. So those dumbbell jabs. In that option, no weight at all. I'm just jabbing it out. We take it up. Dumbbell jabs. Three, two, and one minute. Let's jab it. 
Weights are up, core tight, sit in those hips. Jab it out. Whew. We got that whole mate here. Looking good, crew. Let's snap it. 30 seconds. Whew. So we got that jack press. Again, if you need to drop those weights anytime, go for it. Just jab it out. Whew. Otherwise, we've got just 15. Stay with it if you can. We got one minute of that jack press in three, two, and one. Jack and press for that minute. Let's go. Again, we know I step it out, press it, or keep that weight in by that chest. Find that variation that works for you. Looking solid, crew. Keeping that drive. Thirty seconds. Crew in fifteen. We go those roller coasters for that whole minute. Let's get it ready. We got roller coaster one minute in three, two, and one. Get it arms wide, legs wide. Go underneath that fence line. Push it back up. Looking good. Ooh. Crew, we're coming up on 30 down, 30 to go. Make those edits as you need to. Ooh, about 15 seconds. Give me your best effort here. In three, two, one, take that break. Let's shake it out. So, we technically have three more blocks, but they're all wrapped into one. Two exercises, 30, 30, three laps. Take a 30 second break. Next two exercises. They start with top jacks. So, shoulders over wrist, plank position. Step or hop those feet forward, sitting into that squat, straightening that back for 30 seconds. Then we just hold that squat and pulse for 30. We'll take that 30 second break for three laps. We got a plank jack, shoulders over wrist, feet hop in and out or step them out and in. Option there, any kind of jumping jack you want. Into a V hold, legs can be up, knees can be on the ground, shoulders back, feel that core. Can you always lean it back, get a little extra. Three laps there, 30 second rest. Then we got mid ball swings. So mid ball, we're gonna take it between those legs, hinge at those hips, back to flat, explode up with those hips, punch back down into it. If you're using that dumbbell, you keep those feet where they are, hinge it, and catch it, stopping at that chin height. Then we're gonna take whatever weight we use, up overhead, we got that reverse lunge. When we come back to center, tricep extension. Reverse lunge, back to center, tricep extension for 30 seconds, three rounds there. Crew, let's shake it on out. Get it ready with pop jacks to squat hold. Okay, crew, let's get this ready in three, two, one. Pop jacks, here we go. Again, hit that point position, core nice and tight. Step or hop it up into that squat position, nice flat back. Okay, take that shirt in real quick. Ooh. 
Looking at 10 seconds. Crew in three, two, one. Now we hit that squat and we pulse it. Keep that chest proud so you know you're breathing. Weight out of those knees, don't let them collide in. Already 15 down, 15 to go. This is one of three rounds. So the next two will probably get a little more challenging as we go. Okay, crew, let's get ready. Back to pop jacks in three, two, and one. Here we go. Plank to squat. Looking good, crew. We got 15. Crew, we get that squat hold in three, two, and one. Squat hold. Ooh, yep, that's feeling good. Just 15, best effort. Okay, crew, let's get this ready. Last round, pop jacks, 30 seconds. Three, two, and one. Plank, pop it up in that squat. Looking good, 15 down, 15 to go. Best effort. Looking solid. We'll get that squat hold in three, two, and one. We're gonna pulse it. 30 seconds. Ooh. We're gonna get that break at the end. Just 15. Perfect. Yeah, that feels good. Crew, hang on in three, two, one. Take that break. Catch that breath. We got plank jacks and have V holds. 30-30s. Catching that breath. We got just 15. Again, if you don't want to do those plank jacks, any version of a jumping jack works. You can always step it instead of pop. If we go down, 30 seconds of plank jacks. Three, two, and one. Shoulders over wrists. Pop it out, back in. Remember, it's not about speed, just about getting it done. About 10 seconds. We'll get that V hold in three, two, and one. Flip it on over, V hold. Shoulder blades back, core tight. Again, you can lean it further back for a little bit more. Keep those heels on the ground. You can challenge yourself trying to lift those legs up, but make sure you feel that core first and foremost before you go into those legs. We got 15. Looking good, crew. You can pause those arms if you want some fun. Otherwise, you go back to that plank jack. Three, two, one. Plank jack round two. Looking good. Ten seconds. V hold in three, two, one. Hold that V position. Again, I prefer to lean back, focusing on that core, as opposed to lifting legs. You can always hold on those legs if you need that mod. Or moving those arms, 15. We got one more lap of these two. 
crew in three, two, one, and plank jack. Keeping those shoulders over wrists. Fifteen. Crew, back that V hold in three, two, and one. V hold. Here we go. Core tight. Hang on to it. Ooh, looking good, 15. Two, you get that nice long 30 second break. Count up in just three, two, one. Take that break. Ooh. Last round, mid ball swings into reverse lunge to overhead tricep extension. Ooh. Three rounds there, crew. You can follow along with the dumbbell as well. Just make sure the dumbbell does not go past your height on those swings. And let's get this ready. We start with those hinge swings. 30 seconds in three, two, one. Hinge it, swing it by throwing and catching with those hips. Belly button in that spine, protect that low back. Looking good. 10 seconds. Crew, we got that lunge in three, two, one, arms overhead. Take that reverse lunge. We come together, bending at those elbows. Press it up. Halfway. Getting ready to go back into the swings in three, two, one, hips wide, swing it out. Looking good. 15 down, 15 go. Reverse lunge, overhead extension, three, two, and one. Looking good. Last couple of seconds, crew. So we get to that final round, starting with those swings in three, two, one. Here we go. Last minute work. Looking solid. Last couple of seconds. And we go back in that reverse lunge in three, two, one. Here we go, last 30, staying with it. Whew. Looking good crew, 15. Crew, you've got just three. Two, one, take that break, and you're done. Whew.